guys, Ashley here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I know it's been a hot minute and I've missed you guys and I've missed doing this, but uh, we've been just enjoying the summer months and life has been full, uh, but I definitely want to get back in the rhythm of recording these longer videos for you guys on YouTube. You can always follow me very regularly on social media at ash.weber, but this is a place where you'll find some fuller, longer length videos of different things in life that I wanna journey alongside you guys in. So, one of our latest projects has been our house reno, and let me tell you, I could do a whole nother vlog on what we've learned through this reno, uh, not only about houses and design and um, you know what it looks like to be flexible and pivot when you're having, you know, we had a baby during a reno, and, uh, and what all that kind of looked like. But nonetheless, it was a great experience. We worked with an amazing guy, Adam Gleva. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. If you guys are looking to get any kind of home reconstruction, construction, reno done, small, medium, large, whatever it is, Adam is the guy who is honest, he is hardworking, he puts his heart into the project, he really cares, and he's an expert, uh, he knows what he's doing, and he's done it a bunch, and he's done it in a way that he can tell you, you know, like this is, you know, some options for this budget, or this is some options for a bigger budget. So he can really contextualize the services to really work with anyone, and we couldn't have been happier with the results. So I'm gonna show you guys around, and uh, I hope you guys enjoy. Welcome. As you can see right here is our front entrance area. So we've got new doors right here that just adds such a nice touch. Um, then you see our staircase looks very different. We painted that white and we painted the railing uh, rods black just to add that modern look and feel. We actually had to redo our entire ceiling because there was like a beveled edge around the uh, sides from, you know, I guess styles 20 years ago. So we had to redraw all the ceiling, added the pot lighting. Uh, it just makes for such a beautiful atmosphere in the evenings. Um, we repainted everything white just to make it nice and crisp. We painted this, um, this window casing here black just for a little pop and an accent. Um, of course, we have new floors, which we absolutely love. I wanted to get flooring that looked blonde. Uh, and we added a few new pieces like this rug from HomeSense, our stools are from Wayfair, um, anything else that you see that you might wanna know where it's from, just message me and I'll let you guys know. So this right here was almost the biggest part of the project, this big wooden beam. So we basically took out this entire wall that made this floor once into three rooms and now it is one big open concept and we absolutely love it. Um, this is, um, actually a steel beam that we've kind of cased in with a veneer and uh, again I kind of love that blonde color wood which we really 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 love so this window out here we actually obviously painted the casing black as well as over here we got new light fixtures which just added such a like a lift and a change that doesn't necessarily cost too too much um, we absolutely love our kitchen so we have um, these side wooden floating shelves for an aesthetic look and feel, but they are practical as well. And uh, I love our custom uh, hood range, I think that's what it's called, um, and our island. Oh my gosh, I love the island. So we have a nice big island that we can sit around. We could actually sit two here and four across, so 
We could have eight people at the island um, and we have extra bar stools for that as well when we wanna take them out. But for now, we just kind of place it like this. And of course we have um, this kind of viewpoint and angle this way. Yes, it's a large TV. You can thank my husband for that. Um, so if we come kind of into the kitchen, we have lots of kitchen lighting, which again, Adam was just an expert in knowing you're gonna want lots of lighting in your kitchen. And um, Adam, you know, really told us that with our reno, it's only gonna look brand new with like great new appliances. So of course we got new appliances. I love our large kind of um, pull, pull handles and the shaker style, style cupboards I love as well. And I'm telling you, this sink is worth it. I absolutely love the farmhouse sink. Mm -hmm. This is not renovated, but that's our little backyard which I absolutely love, our little oasis. Um, so obviously here's our stove. This was a really great, um, I'm gonna show you our garbage right now, sneak peek, but that's garbage. Yeah, we had Chinese food last night. And I love the pull-out garbage. I love the microwave in the island. And over here, I absolutely love that we decided to make this section of the kitchen a little coffee nook. Uh, we love coffee, so, and I love that all the appliances here are ready to use at a moment's notice. Everything's plugged in. We've kind of hidden the plugs behind this frame. So we've got our Ninja, kettle, our Nespresso, our toaster. Underneath here, we have all of our cups and anything that we would need for like a beverage. And over here, we just have kind of pantry style inside that cupboard. Up here we have our Nespresso pods and then just some pieces of decor. And I love that we put the um, subway tile all the way to the ceiling. It really elongates the wall and makes the ceilings look higher than they actually are. So that was great. All right, so next into our laundry room. So I absolutely love this room we have. We're gonna actually be reorganizing and kind of redecorating this. This is just kind of for now. So I wanna stylize these shelves a lot differently, but just to kind of give you a look and feel. So we have the shiplap backdrop here, which I love the shiplap. Um, I, you know, love these little things um, for cleaning, cleaning products, just the brown glass spray bottles. And uh, we have obviously, I love the counter space to be able to fold clothes right away. It actually motivates me. To and I love this pull out stool that I can actually pull out and use and actually put my laptop here and do any kind of work as well. It's such a pretty place that actually can kind of double as an office space, which as I kind of continue to stylize these shelves, I'll kind of reflect that as a quasi laundry room workspace. Um, I may change my mind on that, but that's kind of where I'm going for with going for it right now. And in here we have all of our laundry supplies. Uh, we went with front loading washer and dryer, which we love, very compact. Love the style. And as you'll notice, we got all new doors. And we even replaced our doors upstairs as well, which makes it look like we renovated upstairs, but we didn't necessarily. We just got new doors. Um, and so obviously the floors are the same throughout. And then we've kind of done the shiplap wall over here too. Then we just kind of, this door is often open. So we kind of painted the uh, door here black just to kind of create a pop and a sharp look for when this is open. So that is our laundry room. And then let's take a look at this bathroom. Mary Maid's cleaned, yeah, cleaned yesterday, so it should be clean. Uh, so in here, we've just kind of replaced our vanity, uh, painted everything. Then we have our shiplap wall over here and a new toilet. All right, now let me take you downstairs. This was once green carpet. Yes, green. And now we have this modern basement. I absolutely love it. We got the new flooring done. We had drop ceiling before. Now we have a nice uh, finished ceiling with pot lighting. And the floor just makes the room look so much bigger. We have a little TV watching area here with our fireplace and then a little sitting area over here, a little library place for- We redid our bathroom in here. Let's turn on the light. So we've got all of this, little homage to Newfoundland, and then our shower over here, little shower caddy behind. Yeah, so this is our, our new basement. I even love how Adam thought to add this cubby 
for storage underneath our stairs and it can be used as a little cool like play area for lively as she gets older and wants like a cool little hangout. 